So welcome to uh, Superior Drummer here, Killer Drums. Um, I'll be your host, I'm Toby Pittman. And in this tutorial, we're going to go over every aspect um, of ToonTrack Superior Drummer uh, software. So what is Superior Drummer? First off, it's a sophisticated multi-sample drum library. And in my opinion, probably one of the best on the market. It's cross-platform, comes in uh, audio units, VST and RTAS. Uh, you get advanced editing and mapping of your drums, a built-in mixer and effects, a drag-and-drop MIDI player, and also you can uh, render your drums to disc um, as audio files using the offline bouncing. Now, the supplied kit is the New York Avatar kit. And this is a 20 gigabyte sample library, and this is a 20 gigabytes compressed. Uh, you get a load of cool presets, uh, a MIDI groove library. Um, so it's quite a complete package. Now, this is the kit um, that they sampled, and this was sampled at Avatar Studios in New York, uh, which is a great space, and the drums sound fantastic. So what do you get inside the kit? Well, you get all the various kit pieces um, of the drum kit, kick, snare, hats, toms, crashes, rides, cowbell, etc. Now, in the case of the snare drum, you will get uh, seven different snares. I think there's something like 27 crashes, a couple of sets of toms, um, some hi-hats, different kick drums. Uh, so there's a wide selection of instruments to choose from. Now, in the case of a snare here again, and this applies to a lot of the other um, instruments as well, you get the various articulations of the instruments. So for the snare, we have centre, edge, muted, rolls, flams, roughs, etc., etc. Pretty much every sound uh, you could possibly conceive of getting out of a snare drum. Now, on top of that, a couple of the snare drums come recorded using a variety of different tools like sticks, rods, felt mallets and brushes. Now you also get uh, some of the snares sampled with the snares off as well, uh, which adds even more variety. Now the main concept of Superior Drummer is microphones. Uh, so for each of the instruments you get a close microphone and then you get versions of that drum uh, through overheads, ambient microphones and effects microphones. You also get a full set of bleed samples as well, or mic bleed. And this means that the snare is present uh, in all of the other instruments' close microphones, exactly like it would be when you recorded um, a drum kit live. Now, this is an insane amount of samples, and this is just for the snare drum. Um, now, it gets even more insane when uh, you look at the velocity layering inside Superior. Um, you can see here the uh, hard velocity, uh, which is triggered at MIDI 127. Uh, we have one layers, and we have 25 samples just for that layer um, that go round in a random fashion. Then we have gradient hits, um, which are triggered between MIDI velocity 21 and 126. And depending on the instrument, you can have between 15 and 25 layers um, for those uh, gradients with up to 25 hits per layer. Now, that's an even more insane amount of samples. And then you have the soft hits, which are triggered between MIDI velocity 0 and 20, and again, up to 25 hits per layer. 